Hi friends, Aditya his side. Today in this video we are going to learn how to write a regular expression for IPv4 as well as IPv6 addresses. Okay, so before that let's clear few concepts. As we know IPv4 uses 32 binary bits to create a single unique address on the network. Okay, also an IPv4 address is expressed by four numbers separated by dots in between them. Each number is the decimal representation of eight digit binary number. Okay, eight digit binary number is nothing but base two format, also called as octet. Okay, now let us see about IPv6. Uh, did you ever get a question like why we require IPv6? So the reason is, see, if we apply permutation and combinations for IPv6 addresses, as we know, it is having 32 digits, right? So let us, it will be 2 to the power 32 combinations, which will give us only 429 crores of unique IP addresses. And as we are hearing like uh, in future, we will be getting IOT things and all. So these many addresses won't be sufficient. That's why we require IPv6. An IPv6 address uses 128 bits as opposed to 32 bits in IPv4. Okay. Because an hexadecimal number uses 4 bits. This means that an IPv6 address consists of 32 hexadecimal numbers. Okay. These numbers are grouped in fours giving 8 groups. The groups are written separated by a colon unlike IPv4 by dots. Okay. So in this way we write them. So that was about IPv4 and IPv6, right? And if we check like how many unique IP addresses we will be getting in IPv6, so that count will be 2 to the power 128. How this 128 came? See, as there are 8 groups and one group will be containing 16 digits, right? So 16 is a 128. So 2 to the power 128, which is nothing but 3.4 into 10 to the power 38. And that will be more than sufficient for now. Now let's see how to write a regular expression for IPv4 address. Okay. So before that, let's divide this 255 in three parts. Now we need to write regular expression for 250 to 255. First part. Second, we need to write 200 to 249 and third 0 to 199 okay so let us see so let us add carrot and dollar symbols that is start and end notations as there will be four groups right so 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. In between them, there, there is dot. So, first part is done. Now, next. Why I said like we have to divide it in 3 and the first one is 250 to 255. See guys, uh, we can't write 256 here, right? Because 255 is the end. So, that's why we have to divide 250 to 255. First one. So let us do it. 25. It will be fixed. Then as we are dealing with ranges. Means 250 to 255. So I am writing this 0 to 5 range in square brackets. Or it can be 200 to 249. Right. So 0 to 4. It will be first digit will be 2, then next digit will be from 0 to 4, and after that, third digit will be from 0 to 9. Okay. Again, or 
if it is from 0 to 199 so here either it will be 0 or 1 when you are I'll be mentioning uh, more than one digits or characters in square brackets so it will be like only it will take only one out of them okay it is not mandatory so I am giving question mark there again 0 to 9 question mark as it is not mandatory and again 0 to 9 now let us understand this I am not giving question mark here see guys so this is clear now let us look into this if it is 199 so 199 it is possible now let us say if it is 100 100 0, 0 is possible now let us say it is 99 9 and 9 it is possible that's why means we will be dealing with only two digits that's why i kept question mark here okay this is optional now let us say this fourth field will be um, only two so these two are optionals we can directly take two here okay and that's it guys we just have to copy this and add in our next blocks okay so this is how it looks like uh, don't worry i added this regular expression for ipv4 in my description box so just check it okay now let us check if it is working or not let us start with 255.255.255 .255 dot 255 see guys it is working for 225 and 255 now if i am removing this last 5 and adding 6 it should not work right let us see see guys it's not working let us check for 1 see guys it is working so this is how we were supposed to do Okay, now let's see how to write a regular expression for IPv6. So here, first block out of 8 and inside that again there are 4 places, right? So at first place, it can be 0 to 9 or capital A to capital F or small a to small f okay so it can be any of them right at each places so let's start for our regular expression i am removing this now start the carrot and dollar inside that there will be eight blocks okay and as we know we have to separate them with the help of colon see guys escaped character matches colon character ok so syntax is correct so we added colons all across ok now let's start with our regular expression in the first block as i told it will be capital A to capital F small a to small f and 0 to 9 right and as these are ranges we are supposed to give this in square brackets again it will be from first uh, first digit to four digits okay or four characters you can say I think this is correct and now we have to copy this in all the boxes I am just copying this part so we copied it in all the boxes okay so don't worry this string is also there in description box so now let's check if it is working let us start with here Four times f. Okay, so let's copy this and paste it here. See, guys, 
it's working okay it has to work for this also so it's working now let us make few more changes bd 90 let us copy this 9087 abd e it's working okay so this is how it works okay guys thank you for watching see you in the next video if you like it don't forget to share it with your friends subscribe to this channel okay bye bye